Good morning, everyone. Nice sunny day here in West Tennessee. And uh, today we're going to try to raise the tower, tilt over tower project that I've been working on off and on for about two years now. And so if everything goes right, uh, we'll get her up in the air today. There you can see the tower. It's a uh, 50 foot. 10 foot mast on top uh, of course that's down inside the tower some uh, you can see the support pole there that's uh, gonna be used to raise it that's a pretty sturdy pole it was a tubular uh, telescoping tower that somebody gave me years ago and the top had been cut out so it uh, laid around here in my yard for several years and finally when I decided to try to do this project uh, I realized that you know I could use it for that. So it's uh, has the winch on it, pulleys up at the top, and uh, cable runs down to the uh, the tower. I have a another video on the channel that that uh, pretty well shows how all that is set up that you can check out. And over here you see the Mosley HF beam, uh, tri-band beam with. Uh, one element for uh, uh, 17 and 12 meters uh, that's gonna go uh, on the mast. And then above that, we'll have the uh, Cushcraft uh, two meter and 440 beam that you see here. And so we're gonna get all that mounted on there today and attempt to raise it up and uh, hopefully everything will go okay. Easy. She's up. It's up. Both of them. Whiskey Delta Four, Papa Tango Juliet. Papa Tango Juliet, whiskey something, Tango, whiskey something, Papa Tango Juliet, I think. Whiskey Delta Four, Papa Tango Juliet. Papa Tango Junior, 59 plus 20, over over. Uh, QSL, you're 5'9 here in Tennessee. Okay, in Tennessee, fine line. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Talk 72. India too, Victor. Well, it's been a very long but productive day here at uh, WD4PTJ. We got the tilt over tower uh, finally put up. Uh, project uh, long overdue, but uh, it's up now. And uh, you can see it there. I have a uh, give you a rundown. It's got a a Mosley TA33 uh, tribander up top, uh, three elements, and then there's also one element on that that's uh, that's a TA33 Junior. That uh, also has one element on that that's for uh, 17 and, and uh, 20. That's just a rotatable rotatable dipole, and uh, that's at a 50 foot uh, and up. Uh, at the top of the mast above that, about uh, maybe seven foot more up, is a uh, Cushcraft uh, A270-10S uh, beam for uh, 
two meters and uh, 440. And then when you come on down the tower off to the side is a Cushcraft AR 270 uh, ground plane for uh, two meters and 440. Uh, we don't have the wire antennas. I'm gonna, I've got uh, pulleys set up, uh, one on each side uh, to pull up wire antennas. And we'll do that sometime in a later date because uh, I do still have the, the fan dipo uh, out front. But uh, that's, that's what we have. It's, uh, been a long day getting it up, uh, run into problems here and there, but uh, you know, it's up. Guide wire's all secure, Colex all hooked up. Uh, just made the first contact on the uh, HF beam a little while ago with the station in Costa Rica. Got a uh, 20 over 5 9 report, so uh, seems to be working quite well. Uh, when I first heard him, I was pointed north and I could definitely tell, you know, it had good front to back ratio as I came all the way around and got the beam right on him. I could hear the signal come up. So it's got good front to back and uh, good off the side. So that's pretty much uh, what we've been up to today and finally getting it accomplished. And I really have to uh, thank my two sons, thank Preston and Richard. Uh, they've helped me along with this along the way and, and been a big help today. It was a long day and, and uh, pretty strenuous on us. And also uh, my grandson, Jesse McCaslin, who, McCaslin, who's been out here before and helped with it. And uh, for anybody else I can't think of right at the moment that's, uh, that's helped along with this, you know, along the way, anybody that's ever given me any advice, anything, uh, I thank them. But uh, it's finally up and uh, hopefully we'll be able to uh, work quite a bit of uh, DX for some time to come on it. So that's the project uh, that we completed here today at uh, 73 to everybody from uh, here at WD4PTJ.